am Jordan Kidney, and I'm a senior contract teacher in the mathematics and computing department and the general education department. My teaching tip that I have for others is just to truly love your students and be open to learn from them, not just to teach them. It's created a culture that goes beyond my classroom to make it a more enjoyable space, that I get to know my students and know that they're valued and it's not just this course and it has to dominate their entire life, that they're part of a community. I work with myself first and challenge my own thoughts. Saying that words, like even trying to say that I love them before I met them, is that I don't need to know them to love them. I don't need to judge them as I go through. And if I am judging them, question why I am and just be open that I don't know what they're going through and I'd rather just help them move forward as human beings. I don't expect anything specific. I just generally let it emerge naturally and I've had enough evidence to show that this works for me. So be open, be warm, be kind, and actually be compassionate and don't grill them. Don't be a parent teacher, just be a fellow person with them and generally they will come to you. This is why I learned the lesson from them and being open to learn this, because this lesson was from them. And that teaching took over the years of working with students where students who would come up and see me downtown or off campus or on campus, even if I only taught them for six weeks and how much it meant and how they want to check in with me. It's going to be a journey. There's no recipe, just do this one thing. Even when I say the words like love them and learn from them, you'll have to go through your journey for what that means to you. What it means for you to be authentic with your boundaries. Because I can say it, but it's taken a lot of years to learn what was this for me to do it. And for everyone else to just hold that within your heart. Of like, try to love them. Try to learn and question if you're judging them why and learn from your journey of what could you do just to shut up and not judge and listen to them and then question yourself why you're having those thoughts.